Hello, and welcome to this WP Cloud Deploy walkthrough. In this video, we'll take a look at some of the miscellaneous actions you can take on a given site in your WP Cloud Deploy dashboard. From our Cloud Server list in the WordPress Admin panel, we'll navigate to the Apps column and pick the site we'd like to edit. In the Site menu, we choose Miscellaneous. Here we have a number of actions we can take on this site. We can enable password protection for the site, which will cause an authentication prompt to appear when anyone visits the site. This is perfect for sites that are under development and not ready for public consumption. We can go a step further and enable or disable the site completely. Note that when we disable the site, it will be unavailable, but the data will still remain, so you can easily re-enable the site when you're ready to begin working with it again. We can also remove the site completely. This action will delete the site and all data and is not reversible. You can also choose to remove the site and all of its associated backups. Another common action that may need to be performed on your site is changing the PHP version. So let's click the PHP menu item. And here you can see that we have the option to change the PHP version of this site. 